It's a simple thing. Sit quietly when you're touched by the stillness, rest in it, be moved by it. Your heart will open. That feeling of longing that now becomes a sense of relief and ease turns into a feeling of gladness, joy, and then gratitude and love. And that's how you develop your relationship to what lies in the stillness. You don't need very much to complete that journey. You don't. You don't see people like with extraordinary complicated lives having made that connection, entered into it, and lined themselves to that. You don't. Their needs are very few. Because it's really what you came here for. You came here so that you could understand what you are a part of. Because having come to that understanding, you, it will arise in you, that for which I came here to do, I've done. And you'll be at peace with yourself. Just keep listening to your heart. Because it's in your heart that you're connected to that already. Aren't you? Feel from your heart. Whatever challenges and difficulties and obstacles life has thrown your way, let go so that you can return to that basic ground of your being and be touched by it. Feel from your heart. And making reflection on this rare, precious human life that you have. Say to yourself inside three times. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Know that that love that you might be starting to recognize has never for one moment wavered. For all the muddle we've got into, for all the disregard we've shown, it's never wavered for one moment. Endlessly, boundlessly embraces everything. Out of that love, everything arises. That love that you feel inside you when you touch that stillness is the very same love that is everywhere. And when you feel it, you know one with it. And your sense of isolation and separation is over. And you've 
completed your journey home. That's what you came here for. Nothing else. Nothing more than that. rest. Find that natural state of rest so that you recognize there isn't anything you need to add. Feel it, the power of it within you when you just let it express itself through you. only need to rest in it. There is nothing to add. When you ask about how do we get to a state of forgiveness or self-love or acceptance, self-acceptance, you recognize that your pain is only the pain of losing your connection to that. It is a great loss. And our pain and suffering is great on account of it. And it is only on account of that and the confusion that it creates within us that we do these things, that we regret and don't do the things that we wish we should. There is no judgment. That love is unwavering It's never not there. And it's never judged you for a moment. Why should you judge yourself? There's no time you've wasted or lost. It's only this moment. And it's complete within itself. And there's nothing to add. So go beyond merely accepting yourself and forgiving yourself. Love yourself profoundly. Not your idea of yourself with all its vanity. Love the essence of what you are. Which is the essence of every single one of us. So just let go. Trust it. Learn to rest in it. There is nothing to add.